hey guys uh, here we are with yet another video on management tools so the same drill guys i want you to remember these are the key components uh, um, or key service offering from uh, aws as of today so let's get started with management tools uh, uh, under which we have got quite a few services the very first one uh, is uh, cloudwatch uh, it will you know help you to monitor your resources and applications which are hosted inside uh, aws what it does is uh, it creates uh, what do you call it it let you to create you know custom dashboards which will have details like cpu health cpu utilization disk utilization network network you know status network uh, utilization and the uh, instance availability or status so those are the things which you can do with a uh, cloud watch and then cloud formation it is one of the innovative way uh, wherein you get to you know work with templates by using templates you can create and manage resources within aws so uh, if you want to you know uh, uh, create an entire infrastructure you can you know do it uh, within seconds or minutes by using the templates what it does is it converts the entire infrastructure to code and uh, you can you know uh, do all sort of manipulation on that um, without you know uh, thinking about uh, the infrastructure um, you have the flexibility to you know change your own codes and uh, in turn uh, internally it will change the you know resources so that's about our uh, cloud formation and then we have something called as cloud trail what it does is uh, this service from aws it will let you to you know track user activity and uh, the api usage so it will log uh, uh, each and everything uh, what uh, what does uh, the user did how the you know api api was used and uh, so many things and then we have something called as config so this will help you to track resource inventory and changes so you can you can uh, treat your you know infra infrastructure based on the inventory and uh, you can you know apply so many things if you want to you know make uh, make any configuration changes uh, you can you can do it by uh, getting into this config part then we have something called as ops works so what it does is it takes help of a uh, chef chef is an interesting tool um, you know most of the people will be knowing it what it does is it helps you to automate your infrastructure uh, you know if you have you know thousands or uh, more than you know uh, hundreds of servers you can you know uh, automate all of them all the operations uh, by using chef so aws they will help you to you know automate your operations in your infrastructure by using the capabilities of chef so that's what uh, opsworks do then we have something called a service catalog uh, uh, if you want to you know uh, create and use standardized products this is the place uh, uh, you can you can start with and then we have something called as trust advisor as the name says uh, it's a service from uh, aws which will uh, help you to you know um, optimize the performance and security so they have got you know two different versions of uh, trusted advisor uh, you you will get a uh, uh, version in uh, you know free tier and uh, then enterprise uh, tier will have more options so what it does is it gives you, you know advices based on your uh, infrastructure and the application it it scans all the things and then it will you know uh, throw you with uh, you know advices on performance how to optimize it how you can you know improve the security and so on so that's all uh, for uh, for now guys thanks a lot for watching the video i'll see you in the next one